In this video of source tools I will show you how to activate the item drop notification so you may already know t, uh, tf2items.com and tf2stats.com.net offer um, email notification if you get item drops however with source tools you can customize that in terms of um, you don't want to get notified for every single unlocked drop you get um, so anyway you can launch source tools you go and configure profile you select your profile you go and add on manager okay item drop tracker notifier so the first part track drops um, okay so you need the add-on to be enabled in the first place so it should be with easy spectate um, here second option is to choose between the draw steam item manager and krypton laws tf2 items monitor tools uh, you can already read the description when you first launch easy spectate um, so we'll skip right away, t right away to uh, notification, email notification option 7. So you need to enable this first of all. Then uh, you want to set how many items drop before you receive an email. So maybe you want to know that you've received 5 unlocks or you can change the value something higher or lower. And the other one is how many had drops. Uh, which usually if you get one you might want to know since it doesn't happen more than once a day or even less. Um, then you need to configure your email account. Um, so by default it's set to use Gmail so you need to but you can also type in a different server address and port then you type in your username login your password uh, the email address that will be shown when you send an email notification. With Gmail, it doesn't really matter, but you should still type in your email address. Uh, and then the address to which you want to send it. So either you receive it to your work email or your cell phone email to SMS port. Um, and that's it. It's pretty simple like this. Uh, if you want to test uh, your email account, uh, I will show you how to do this. Okay, so I have open source tools here. Um, once you're launched in the game, you can type in several commands in source tools. Uh, one of them for testing your email notification is hat drop or item drop. So if we type in here hat drop, then uh, I open my email account to which I choose to send it to. And if I refresh, I still haven't received anything. There we go. I have found test hat one two three four five, and you can do item drop. Well, it's pretty much the same thing. It's just a message is different. It should be any second. There we go. And that's it. If if you get those messages, it means your email account is properly set up in Source Tools, and you should receive notifications. And that is all. So. See you in a different video for different settings. Goodbye.